Hey, this is Reagan Ram, and are you someone who struggles with being able to consistently post new great content uh, out there in the world? So maybe you've heard that uh, the number one way to uh, generate traffic is through being consistent and consistently posting valuable content, but what if that's a struggle for you? How do you, you know, ramp up your consistently consistency in your content creation? Well, that's what I'm going to talk about in this video, and the best way to do this is kind of a, a little uh, kind of secret tip that you know a lot of people don't do is what you do is you record a short video, maybe two to three minutes, three to four minute video, short video, and then you use that one video to create multiple forms of content. So what do I mean by that? So you create your video and then you post this video, uh, you make a blog post out of it. So you take the video, post it in a blog post, um, maybe take the first point that you make in your video. So it's not even like a full transcript, but just taking, maybe if you make three points in the video, just take your first point, kind of describe that. Uh, maybe you just take a transcript of it, you just copy what you say, post it in the, as a content in the, in the blog post. And then you say if you want, you know, the rest, the other two tips, just watch this video, which you can post at the, you know, the bottom of the, the blog post. So you've got your video, now you've got a blog post. Um, you still, you can take that video, you can upload it to YouTube. You've got now this video on YouTube, which you can share. Um, you can also take that video and you upload it directly to Facebook because Facebook prefers um, con videos that are natively uploaded. So they're not taken from YouTube and posted. Um, what do I mean by like? I mean, uh, Facebook will show it to more people if you directly upload the video to Facebook instead of YouTube. So now you got your, you got this, you got a blog post, you got, you got this video on YouTube, you got a blog post, you've got a video that you've put on Facebook, and then you can even take the audio from that video and create a podcast out of it. So now here you are, you've done this, you know, short video under five minutes, and you've got a blog post, you've got video on YouTube, you've got content for your social media, um, you've got um, podcast. So you've got all this content, all these different forms of content from, you know, one five minute investment. And to max, the way to maximize this content is to kind of spread it out. You don't want to post it all at once. But um, so like if you, you know, do the video, you might, you know, post it on you know, if you're going to create your blog post first, then you'll want to post the blog post first on on Facebook because you want to get the traffic to your blog post first, and then later you might upload the video directly separate from the blog post. Um, and then you know you might upload it to YouTube later, and then maybe later on you'd create uh, take the audio from that and create a podcast. So it's kind of um, you know not all it's not all the same thing all at once, but it's kind of spread out a little bit and uh, that way, you know, people didn't hear it the first time who missed it. They can, maybe they'll, they'll get it later in a, in a different form. Um, there's some people that, you know, maybe don't read blog posts. They only watch videos. Some people that, you know, they only have time to listen to podcasts while they're driving to work or whatever. So it's not like you're going to be overwhelming people with this content if you're posting the same piece of content in different forms. Because, you know, first of all, people, people could just miss it. Second of all, um, People might only consume certain formats. Uh, thirdly, you know, you have if you're growing, if your business is growing, then you're going to be having new people liking your page, following your blog, who you know missed it the first time around. So, also, I mean, even if people have read it the first time, they won't mind hearing it again in a different format. Sometimes you need to hear things multiple times for it to stick. So, definitely do this. You know, create one piece of content uh, and use it, and multiply it, and use it to make multiple. Uh, forms of content. So, and then the easy, again, the easiest way to do it is just with a short video. Um, is the easiest way to just do that because it's so easy just to go out there and shoot a video, um, even if you're an introvert like me. So, um, it might seem difficult at first, but the more you do it, the easier it's going to get. So, just you know, force yourself to do it, and then you'll be happy you did. And um, if you still feel like you need some help, you know, you're not sure what to say or how to say it, um, I'll post a link in the description to a free guide. You can get which will uh, kind of teach you the script and how to go about making one of these sh short uh, three to four minute videos. 
Um, so I hope you got value out of this video. Um, just let me know in the comments if you uh, have any questions or if anything didn't make sense about, about this video and I'll be sure to um, explain. And uh, if you know anyone who uh, you think would benefit from this video, then be sure to tag them. And uh, again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.